Welcome to another vlog from the way we saw it today from Oaxaca City and we have been already in Oaxaca City you can see the videos up there but last time we didn't have enough time and we couldn't see everything so this is why we came back as well to Oaxaca City to see the things we couldn't do last time but before we head out of town let's go and have breakfast this actually here is our Airbnb we will put the link in the video description below if you never have stayed with Airbnb and you click on the link you get a discount I think it's $25 on your first booking and we will also get I think $20 a credit on our account this Airbnb is really nice because it's on top of the building and gives you this spectacular view all over Oaxaca with the churches there's a little outdoor sitting area there as well and uh, so let's go and have breakfast So a friend told us there's an organic food market uh, just very close to our hotel where you also can have breakfast and that's where we are going right now. And Oaxaca city is actually uh, the capital city of the state of Oaxaca, of course. You can choose wherever you want to sit and all the restaurants here you can order whatever you want in different restaurants so for example this one provides the juices which is actually over there and this one has broccoli celery spinach parsley nopal and orange and this one called verde alcalico alcalino has cucumber ginger parsley spinach, uh, celery, pineapple and water. And what is nopal again? Nopal is like a cactus, like a young cactus leaf which you eat like a salad and you take the little uh, little needles. needles away and then you eat it. That's very healthy. very green and now the main course has arrived and this is just an amazing uh, avocado toast with a poached egg but so beautifully arranged on the plate and this um, tableware also that the, the plate is also with this local um, pottery done so beautiful and this plate only costs four US dollars incredible delicious green breakfast the next point will be also something green we are going to the botanical garden in Oaxaca city and it's more like a garden with all the cactus and well we will show you more details later and all of those of you who are following us for a longer time already know that we love botanical gardens so let's have a look at this one the tour costs 100 pesos per person and it includes an umbrella and a hat because there's no shade in the botanical gardens and you get all the information on the website of the botanical garden of Oaxaca about the tours and the languages we chose today an English speaking tour so the plant you just see right now is the chia plant and in this botanical garden here actually they have over 900 different species of the state of Oaxaca and they aim to get up to 1200 or 1300 different plants here in this botanic garden but that would only make 10% of the whole 
variety of plants they have in the state of Oaxaca. It's pretty crazy. So this what you see here is actually wild mice. And you know, mice is the most important food, or let's say corn is the most important food in Mexico. And this is kind of like how it all started. You can see the corn is more, uh, not round, it's like a triangular. So this is how everything started about <laughs> and ended actually at the end in the tortilla. Behind me you see the Cardon cactus. This is one of the biggest cactuses in the world. And this one can be around 60 to 80 years. It always depends how much water the cactus finds and how fast it can grow then. So they might be really big, but if they have water, they are not so old. the beautiful botanical garden it is super super hot there's almost no wind even the dogs look for the best place in the shadow and we are heading now to have a coffee let's go and there's a big wedding today and in the botanical garden you could already see a little bit the setup for this event they're gonna have tonight and the couple is just coming out of the cathedral <laughs> After this beautiful botanical garden we got a coffee and a haircut and now we are in the textile museum of Oaxaca. Oaxaca has a very long uh, artisanal tradition, textile tra tradition. You probably have seen these beautiful blouses with all these flowers on top. And there's this textile museum where we are now and they have different exhibitions. We have been here already last time but it's so beautiful so we want to see it again. Let's have a look. Eres perfecta mujer, de la cabeza a los pies, tú pasas de mi nivel, tú tienes el piquete, de la forma que tú besas mami, más simétrica que un origami, de la forma que tú besas mami, más simétrica que un origami. Eres perfecta mujer, de la cabeza a los pies, tú pasas de mi nivel, tú tienes el piquete. De la forma que tú besas, mami Más simétrica que un origami De la forma que tú besas, mami Más simétrica que un origami We are now in the Amate bookstore in uh, Oaxaca and if you are running out of some reading matter for your vacation or your trip definitely come here. They have the widest selection of English speaking books and there's just a child singing on the street very not in the right tone but it's a little bit of competition between me and the child. So 
this bookstore here is really beautiful and really recommendable. We will put the address in the video commentary below. Don't miss it when you come to Ochakaitz in the uh, Protestant area of the city. <laughs> This was another vlog from the way we saw it from Oaxaca City. Oaxaca City is actually quite small. There's only 260,000 people living here. Probably the most hipster town of this size anywhere in the world. It has a brilliant culinary scene and a brilliant arts scene also. So this place is actually a great place for vacation and for a holiday. Thank you for watching the way we saw it. Safe travels always. Bye.